good world? This is your boy, Go Easy on the Kicks, and we're kicking off a special edition of What's in the Box. Now, this is not just any ordinary edition. Today video is a little bit different. We're making a jump from IGTV to YouTube, but this is the first video I'm uploading on my YouTube. I want to make sure to kick this off with a bang. So you may be like, hmm, go easy. How are you going to do that? I wanted to get a shoe that I've been waiting to get for a while. It actually came out last year. Might give you a couple of guys a couple hints on it. But before we get started with the unboxing, let's make sure I have everything I need. So do I have my knife? Check. Do I have hand sanitizer to handle the box? Check. Do I have disinfectant wipes? Check. And of course, I do make sure to wipe down everything. Without further ado, I think let's go ahead and move to my workstation and get started with the unboxing. All right, so we got everything we need. Let's go ahead and get into like myself what number Jordan is in this box but what Jordan is it so let's see and yes here we have the defying moment Jordan 1 from LA 2 shot I've been waiting to get this shoe for a while ask all my buddies this has been one of my recent grails, I should say, that I've been trying to get into my collection. Um, just overlooking the shoe a little bit, making sure I don't see anything out in the ordinary. Let me make sure. Yes, yeah, so let's make sure that we check out the other shoe as well. And yes, you know, it comes with that purple and I wouldn't say Laker gold, but I would say a little bit more like a New Orleans Saint gold, but it's purple and gold. So we do have the LA purple and yellow colorway. And to compare them to another release that came out around the same time, I brought out the NYC Two Pairs Nike One SB collab. These are both a home run collab. I'm talking about the release, I was a huge fan of the LA to shot. I wanted these so bad. So yes, I'm finally glad that I have it in my collection. These are definitely was a pair of grails that was missing. I definitely can't brag so much about this shoe, man. I'm so happy to actually have it. I think we haven't seen a SB Jordan 1 collab since the Lance Mountain. So when these was announced, everybody jumped on board, especially when they was released at Selective Skate Shop. So I try to do all I can do to get all my raffles in, jump online, and I'm so happy that I'm about to bust these out for the summertime. Like purple matted yellow with a little bit of white and black with the light bone gray and a little bit of undertone pink, which just has the undertone red. Again, these are definitely a knockout the park grab. If you didn't get a chance to get them, I definitely recommend to get these. And if you do like them, you can actually get these a little bit cheaper on the market. Again, what do you think about the LA to shot or even the NYC to Paris? Do you have a favorite between the two? And do you think that Jordan brand need to continue to do collections and collabs like these in the future? I'm definitely looking for different colors. So we know they're going to sell out if they do them. Maybe they're just waiting for next year to actually have a bigger market. But what do you guys think? Would you happy that these shoes drop? And were you able to actually get them for retail? Please let me know what you think in the comments below. Make sure to like the video, click on that subscribe button, and follow me over on Instagram at Go Easy on the Kicks. It's your boy Go Easy on the Kicks. Everybody be safe, stay blessed. Until next time, have a good one.